Hey guys, we are currently in the Ballard Brewing District. There is breweries everywhere. Uh, just down here to my left, we've got Wheelie Pop, we've got Fair Isle Brewing. Uh, as you can kind of see, I am currently in front of Ruben's Brews. We're gonna go inside, we're gonna have a beer. I'm not feeling great, so we're gonna go check it out. I'm just gonna have a beer and not do a taster tray. Uh, that building over my right shoulder, which if you're looking at the left shoulder, that is actually a tasting room, the Ballard tasting room for Great Notion Brewery. So you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna head on in here. I already grabbed a beer. Let's check out, see what we got with Rubens. So there is quite a few breweries in this area. I know Stoop Brewing is next to here. Uh, Obeck is just around the corner. Like I said earlier, that is a Great Notion tap room. You also have the tap room for uh, Bale Breaker, which is out of Yakima. They do have a food truck here. We'll get a closer look at the hours, but this is their beer garden. I got a bunch of information to give you on Ruben's Brews. It's really a neat place. It's one of Seattle's more popular breweries. They don't have a menu up, but here's the hours of operations for the food truck for Ruben's Eats. Gonna give you an idea. Also, Rubens is having an Oktoberfest on September 16th. Head on in here. Large, large beer garden. I got set up right over there. It's beautiful here, though. It's nice. Got a big old fire pit. really is a pretty neat place. Rubens is very popular as far as a bunch of merch. All kinds of shirts, several medals they've won. They have events here also all the time. Every Wednesday they have trivia. We missed the block party. They even have socks. How awesome is that? Big sponsors of Ballard FC. All the taps that they have on. I went with the World of Beer Cup winning Hazelicious Hazy IPA on the top up there. Check it out. Bunch of beer to go. And of course, they brew all the beer right back here. Go out, set up, give you a little history on Ruben's Brews. Check it out. Okay, everyone, a little history on Ruben's Brews. Its motto is one brewery under three roofs. Adam Robbins is the owner, head brewer. So the brewery opened in 2012. Adam was an award-winning home brewer named Brewery after their first son, Ruben. Their mission statement is, at our family brewery, we brew each beer from a glass backwards, designing each beer with intentions unbound by constraints. The Pilot Brewery opened 2012 in Ballard and closed to the public in 2015 when the tap room opened, but still brew pilot batches every week on their five barrel system. The tap room, it opened in 2015, which features the brewery right in the middle of the tasting room, where the beer they brew that you'll taste in both the tap room and distribution. This is a 15 barrel system is what they have here. So the production brewery is where they brew majority of the beer you'll see in cans and bottles in a 30 barrel brew house, which I believe is right around the corner. So, and I, that's where the canning line is also. So that's their second tasting room, but I'm not sure how often it's open. So here's a little timeline on Ruben's Brews. In 2010, Adam became a home brewer. In 2012, the original brewery opened. In 2013, they began bottling for the first time. 2015, the tap room at the brewery, which is where we're at now, at 5010 14th Ave Northwest opened. 2016 goes, first canned beer, won its second goal, the GABF. So in 2016, they had their first canned beer, which is their Gose. In 2018, they received their 200 medals, 
making them the most decorated in the state. Again, they are a very popular Seattle brewery. In 2019, the first beers are packaged in the new production facility. In 2020, Crikey IPA was named the best North American beer at the 2020 Brussels Brew Challenge. Adam has a podcast called Side Glass. It's really, really good. It's really informative. He talks a lot about beer, how they brew it, all that. I went today with their Hazelicious. Uh, it's won several awards. I was going to get a taster tray today, but I'm just not feeling great. So I figured I'd come out here and just get a glass and check it out and see what the brewery's all about. So those of you looking to come visit down here at Rubens Brews, they are open seven days a week at the tap room from 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. They're pet friendly. They're family friendly. Come down, grab a bite to eat, have a beer or two, and just check it out. Support your local breweries. Anyways, that's probably going to be it for today. I'm going to finish up this beer, and we might head to a couple more breweries. There's about 10 of them, 10, at least 10 in this area. So we'll go from there. Anyways, thanks for watching. Uh, like the channel, subscribe. Uh, tell your friends about it. Let's grow the channel so people can get the word out there, and, and then they can see where they want to go drink beer.